if someone said to me, you're going to go to the Paralympics with Heath Davidson, when I was playing basketball and uh, we hadn't spoke to each other, I would have said, good one. That'll do it. They've done it. A first ever doubles gold for Australia. I remember our first tournament, it was called the Thaguna Thikun Open in, in Albury, Wodonga. Wodonga. How's that? It was on mod grass. We were so fat, couldn't push our chairs on the mod grass. Our dads bought us matching kits, so we used to wear matching shirts and play doubles. What losers? I love this dude. He is my rock out there. I love you, brother. You had a 10 year break from the sport. I mean, when I left tennis when I was 18, I, my mindset was it was done. I don't think I meant for it to be this long, but everything that was going on outside of tennis and stuff took over my life. Just hanging around with the wrong people, getting myself in a little bit of trouble, just gradually got worse and worse. I think my mum pushed me to get involved in this youth centre. It was just a boxing gym, wanted to get involved in fitness and sort of get my life back on track. It took a long time for me to realise that I really did love the sport and meeting a, meeting a girl, I guess, turned, turned my head around and sort of gave me the kick in the behind that I needed to sort something out. We were watching Wimbledon one night and she said, why don't you go back and give it a shot? The next day I rang my old tennis coach and I hadn't spoken to him for seven years. And he said, come down and have a hit. Started hitting once a week. Once a week turned into twice a week. Twice a week turned into a phone call from these guys saying, hey, come down. When he first came back, he was pretty ordinary, but he, it, was, it was like a penny drop three months after being back and he was all of a sudden hitting like a, a proper awesome tennis player. The one person that I can't thank enough is Dylan, because and he's the reason I come in every day. I get to play with the best quad tennis player in the world. If Heath misses every serve, I couldn't care less because I know he's trying his best. Same if I missed every shot. He's not letting me down if he misses a shot. There's no way he can let me down. That's the best decision I've ever made. I'm glad, he, I'm glad he came back as well. He was unbelievable today. Oh my God, I can't believe it still. Not many guys get to play with one of their best friends. I think that is what separates us from the other teams is that Friendship and bond and camaraderie that I guess gets us through those moments. Cause we